Hey guys, it's Hodgepodge here, and today we are going to be doing a review of the Carnegie 1989 Myasaura figure. Now, Myasaura was a hadrosaur dinosaur that lived in the Two Medicine Formation of Montana 76 million years ago during the Late Cretaceous period. Its name means Good Mother Lizard, in reference to the way this dinosaur presumably cared for its young. And it did not sit on this nest like this model depicts. I was getting to that. As I was saying, this creature is very interesting. Whilst the colour scheme isn't the most interesting thing in the world, I think this model does look very naturalistic, and I think the colour scheme is very believable. Well, I actually like the colour scheme for this model. But, but you know what? Fine, you take over the review then. There we go. Ah, uh, yes, in all seriousness, this Myasaur is a really cool model. I like the retro feel of it. I know a lot of people go for more accurate depictions of Myasaur when it comes to buying dinosaurs, but I just, there's some, there's some sort of charm about these old Carnegies that have made me collect them for so long. A more accurate depiction of the Myasaur came in 1996. Uh, this version, instead of sitting on its nest, was depicted with two nestlings. Uh, which are extremely cute. That's why I wanted this model when I was a kid. I actually also have a more accurate representation of Myasaur in this 3D printed model that I printed off at school and... Aren't you supposed to be reviewing the one 1989 version? What? I can have passion for different dinosaur models. I have more than you anyways, so... You know, you know what? Fine. You, you take the damn review over. That's what I was doing! Oh, oh my god. Careful, this thing's old and expensive. Like your mom? <laughs> now, back to the model. The Carnegie Collection was a toy line manufactured by Safari LTD until the entire line was retired in 2015, making these models highly sought after and difficult to find. They're also very outdated by today's standards, but we have to expect that from figures from the 80s. Ah uh, yes, but your Myasaur lacks the distinctive crest that Myasaur was known for. The, the, the brow. Yes, I was getting to that. When it comes to the limbs, proportionally they seem correct. However, the feet are quite inaccurate. On the back feet, the middle toe should be longer and the front toes should all form a fleshy pad rather than functioning as individual toes. The tail is also too short and shouldn't be bending halfway down its length. I honestly don't know which one I prefer. I do like the more accurate 1996 version, but there's just something about this one that makes me like it slightly more. However, I can rub the fact that I own this in Hodge's face, because he does not own the new 1996 version, and I do. What do you gotta say about that, Hodge? <laughs> Double haha. -ha. Um, now anyways, let's get to the measurements, which I didn't bring a ruler for, so we're gonna go back into the house and get that. I have returned from my bedroom with my ruler. I don't know why it was in my bedroom. Uh, anyways, let's get to the measurements. All right, so now that I have gotten my trusty ruler, uh, let's get some measurements. So, but going lengthwise, this figure's about maybe, I'm gonna say seven and a half, eight inches long. And then going up, it's about three and a half inches tall and it's, at its tallest. Inches? Ugh, bloody Americans. Wait, why'd you have a ruler next to your bed? Um... No reason. You know what? You just take the damn model. The detail on the skin on this model is very good. It doesn't look too elephant-like, but also doesn't look overly scaly either. It's a good balance. In all seriousness, this is a great little model. 
I highly recommend getting it if you like more vintage style figures. Um, I agree. This is a very cool figure if you can get your hands on it. While it isn't perfect, it has a certain charm to it, which is why I love it, and all the vintage Carnegies. Uh, it's a pity that the line went under in 2015. Anyways, I'm John. And I'm Hodge. Thank you, John, for joining me for this review, and thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye now. Bye.